Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have an important deadline you need to know about in order to still get your back pay. So we know that the pandemic unemployment assistance programs ended on September 4th, but you can still receive payments for those weeks that you were unemployed before that September 4th deadline by backdating. But you have to backdate before October 6th, as this is the last day to apply for a PUA claim and have it backdated. I'm going to walk you through the process of backdating and then show you how to expedite that by reaching a representative at the EDD on the phone. So the first thing you need to do to file a backdating application is go to askedd.com. And when you get here, select Unemployment Insurance Benefits. Then scroll down to the subcategories and select Claim Questions. Then select the box on the top left of the screen to backdate your claim. Then this page will pop up giving you some information about backdating a claim and select Continue. Next, you'll need to enter your contact information, and then at the bottom of this page is where you select the date to backdate your claim to. It's super important that you use this exact format as listed here, so type backdate my claim to the month slash day slash year that you are requesting to backdate and select submit. Because there is so little time to get this done, I highly recommend that you call the EDD to have them look it over and have it backdated. And I'm sure that you're all well aware of how difficult it is to call the EDD and actually reach a live agent. So that's why for this, I'd highly recommend using a third party calling service called Claimer. They call the EDD for you and then connect you to a hold line with a live agent. And it only takes about an hour and you are guaranteed to speak with an actual agent. When speaking with the agent, they will probably ask you a few of the following questions. So make sure that you're prepared for that. Some of the things that they might ask you are your basic information like your name, social security number, address, or phone number, and the name of your last employer and the last date that you worked for them. It's also possible that they will ask you why you didn't file a claim or certify during the time that you are backdating to, so make sure that you're prepared for all of that. After speaking with an agent, you should receive an email that looks like this, and that means that they are doing a validation process, which is a good thing. Most users reported that they were able to certify within 24 to 48 hours after speaking with an agent. I have a link to that calling service I mentioned earlier, Claimer, website here in this video's description, so you can get that there. So there is still a little bit of time for you to receive these pandemic unemployment benefits if you have not received those weeks of payments yet, but you do need to act quickly. Let me know in the comments if you guys have any questions, and take care, I'll talk to you soon.